do a post pattern yeah. this time. Very thankful for medical technology that exists today you know, that can make a, a positive impact uh, on our health. It's, uh, it's amazing that you think about something so small having an impact on a person as large as myself. You know, I think about uh, that stent that's in my body you know, all the time. I think about the, the process uh, that they went through to place it there. I think about the balloon that cleared the, the clot you know, um, uh, in my artery. And uh, you know, it's, it's amazing that uh, the technology exists. It's amazing that it's available uh, to everyday people uh, like ourselves. It was Martin Luther King Day and uh, we had the day off from work. And uh, like any other day when I have a, a day off, I want to get into the gym. I got on the elliptical machine, which is uh, uh, something that I started to enjoy doing. I'll never forget the time. It was 20 minutes and 23 seconds, and uh, I felt this pain uh, in my chest. And uh, it wasn't so much a pain as it was pressure. I just started thinking to myself, you know, what is going on here? You know, what's happening? And um, in the re far recesses of my mind, uh, you know, the thought of a heart attack uh, was there. And uh, it was something that I, I didn't want to be true. Finally got to the hospital and um, it was scary. You know, it was scary, really scary at that point. The room was full of people. Um, they were lit literally cutting off my shirt. They confirmed that I was having a heart attack. The doctor came in and, and told me that I was going to going up to the catheter lab and I was going to have a procedure, uh, a catheterization, and uh, and they were going to go in into my heart and see where the blockage was and try and clear it. I ended up getting one having one stent placed in uh, my ramus artery. While I was in the room waiting to go up to the catheter lab. You know, I was really thinking about my father, and uh, many years earlier, he'd had to have a um, quadruple bypass surgery. And uh, it was a successful surgery, but the recovery from a surgery like that is really brutal. And uh, I've had to watch that, and I've watched my mom go through that since. So, uh, you know, understanding that uh, this catheterization process, you know, with the balloon and stent technology, uh, you know, just knowing that that was available and an option for me uh, really made me feel good and gave me peace of mind in that moment that uh, with a skilled physician, you know, really using this medical technology to my benefit really meant that I had a good chance for a positive outcome. It's amazing that, um, you know, you have people out there with just the generosity of, you know, a spirit and, and caring that, uh, you know, will take the time and really focus and create these life-saving products and techniques. It's enabling me to uh, live a full life now. And, uh, you know, after having a, a heart event like that, um, you know, you really, you know, it makes you take stock uh, of your life and it makes you appreciate the things that, uh, that you do have.